Dust is probably one of the best desert sounding tracks I've heard in a while and I can't wait to re-listen to this song again with you guys because I've honestly haven't heard this in a while so I can't wait to listen to this again and break it down with you guys. Hi everyone my name is Noctis Curious. I've been a singer here on YouTube for about six years now and I'm super excited to dive into the song and break it down with you guys on why this is one of the best desert songs in video game history. Okay, before we get into that, I want to break down the intro for a bit. That was a pretty good intro. It really helped to set the scene and the tone. It really helped paint a setting. That is helped by the fact of the train noises, which gives obviously gives off the impression of a train, as well as the sort of Middle Eastern slash Egyptian slash desert sort of string instrument there that is typically heard and Middle Eastern slash Egyptian music as well. That really helps to give the sort of vibe of a desert as countries located in the Middle East are of course located in a desert. So that really helps to give that sort of atmosphere to that song, which really helps to engage the listener. And now we get in. The vocals. Ah, oh, yes, that drop. There's so many layers to the song. That's Amazing. Yeah, the Middle Eastern stringers maintaining that melody of the song. Oh, adding more elements. Ooh, the chopped up vocals as well, okay. Let's help provide some more rhythm. Okay, I want to talk about that drop a little bit. That drop was great in so many ways. First and foremost, that rhythm there it really helped to give a sort of bouncy feeling. That sort of bouncier feeling. While the rhythm was a bit repetitive, I think it makes sense in the context of which this plays. It sort of gives a sort of train moving forward feeling. It gives a sort of like train, bouncy train. And the chopped up vocals there also really help to add on to that rhythm. And also the synthesizer on the dancing synthesizer as well helped to add a bit more variation. But at the core of that drop, was the Middle Eastern string instrument. I don't know what it's called, so apologies. Really helped to provide a bit of more of a melody as well. Ooh, a little break, this little break.
Oh, the auto tune vocals. Okay, before we get back into the drop, I just love that sort of incorpor incorporation of sort of what sounds to be a almost real life snare in a sense, or some sort of Middle Eastern drum, I think. I'm not quite sure. But the incorporation of the autotune vocals was great as well, and really helped to remind you that this is still in the future. Ooh, that appreciated synth really helps to give a bit of a rhythm there. Oh, and reintroducing all the elements of the song slowly, okay. Ooh, a change in the synth, synth melody, okay. And the choir at the end of the final drop. Yes. Just yes. Again, one of the best desert songs I've ever heard in video games. I won't lie. And I want, really want to talk about the final drop right now. Because I love how in the final drop, just everything comes together. Just everything, all the instruments, everything just comes together. And the incorporation of the choir in the final drop as well really does help give that sort of epic and big feeling to a song, which is what a drop should do and what makes a great drop. But what also helps a great drop is the buildup to said drop. And that buildup to said drop is a bit unorthodox, but it works and is amazing. The buildup to that drop really started when slowly all the elements and layers of the song was reintroduced after that sort of cutaway from most of the drums in the song and really helped to build hype and anticipation. And what the song really gives off is a sort of, I can do this, we're here, let's go, let's eliminate this threat and let's finish it. So yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please drop a like on this video. And also, if you want to see more, please subscribe. And please let me know what you thought of the video down in the comments below. And yeah, thank you guys again so much for watching. Remember to stay humble and be kind to people. I'll see you guys later.